Hello and welcome to Simple Yet Savvy. I am Vijaya and I make videos on budget makeovers, minimizing and saving time and money. I know most of us have been doing a lot of cooking these days. I know I am because we have totally switched to home cooked meals, which means that I'm doing a lot of meal planning, uh, meal prepping and also I am buying a lot of groceries these days because I am cooking a lot. So this video and the next few videos in the series are going to be centered around topics such as meal planning, meal prepping, buying groceries, um, healthy cookware, labeling and having a better organized kitchen. So if you like what I'm saying, hit that like button because that lets me know that you would like to watch these videos. So let's begin with the first video of this series, which is seven reasons why I like to label everything in my kitchen. I have been labeling all the groceries and jars in my kitchen from the time I can remember. It's a habit picked up from my mother. And if you're wondering what labels have got to do with saving time or money, then let me share seven reasons why I label everything in my kitchen and how that helps me get so much more done for so much little. First of all, labels create a very cohesive or uniform look and feel. And chances are that your kitchen is also filled with jars and bottles and canisters of all shapes and colors and sizes just like mine. Going forward, when I'm going for a new container, I am going to make sure that it's similar to what I already have. But at this point, I feel that throwing perfectly good containers just to make them all look similar and uniform is not very sustainable and neither it is pocket friendly. And that's where labels come to our rescue. By adding similar looking labels, we can visually tie together all these different jars to look very similar to each other. And as a result, my cabinets look quite put together without burning a hole in my pocket. My second reason for labeling is that it makes my kitchen more accessible to one and all in the family. Ours is a home with elders and children. So in my kitchen, I make it a point to keep everything at eye level or slightly lower. I didn't want to worry too much about uh, somebody having to step up on a stool or a step ladder to reach something high up on a shelf. So this is how my groceries line up. We get to see all the containers from the top. So it makes so much more sense to have labels instead of having to take out unlabeled jars to open the lids and then to find the right ingredients. So how many times has it happened that you put together a perfect system for organizing your groceries in place and then two weeks later, nothing was where it was meant to be. And before we know, things start piling at wrong places because we're not putting them back where it belongs. And that's where labels help. With labels, we can organize like things together, such as spices, oils, staples, and it just helps everything to be kept that way. My reason number four is also uh, one of my favorites because it enables anyone to cook. Of late, my husband has been doing a lot of cooking. My daughter is also venturing out in the kitchen more often these days, trying her hands at cooking. And then whenever my mother or my mother-in-law are around, they also like to cook a lot. So having a well-labeled kitchen goes a long way in making all of them feel comfortable and welcome at the kitchen. It just makes everyone feel at home and feel in control of the kitchen. Everything is easy to find and easy to reach and knowing what is where and within reach just makes the whole process so much more easier and ends up saving so much more time for everyone. Reason number five to label your groceries is that it makes stock taking so much more easier. You'll be able to spot at a glance what you need when you're making your list of groceries. And this will save you a lot of time and money. I'm able to avoid wastage because I'm not ordering what could be already there at home. Sometimes you do that, right? You know that you have bought something, you know it's already there at home, but you just can't find it and you don't have the time to look for it. So you end up ordering it again. And then you're left with four packets of rava or two packets of flax seeds. So labeling helps you shop at your pantry first before the store. Now reason number six is again one of my favorites because it lets anyone to put away the groceries. Labeling will help you get your family on board with your system of organizing the groceries, which means when your groceries arrive from the store, it doesn't have to keep sitting on the countertop demanding your attention to be put away. It just makes 
the whole chore so much more delegatable. I mean, it just becomes so much more easier for anyone to put away the grocery and that just takes one item off your list. And finally, reason number seven is that it just makes cooking so much more fun. Cooking can get really cumbersome, especially when every meal is home cooked. However, a tidy kitchen where we know what's available and where is it kept helps us enjoy the whole process of cooking so much more. For me, it just takes away the stress from the process and helps me put a little more heart in preparing healthier and nourishing meals for myself and for my family. And that's all I had for you all today. I hope you like these ideas and some of the things that we discussed today have inspired you to try out labeling in your own kitchen. So if you found this video helpful, please make sure that you subscribe for more such videos on simplifying and frugal living. I'm gonna leave some more videos that I think you might like right here. I'll see you soon. Bye for now.